Okay, okay, you guys caught me. I just wanted an excuse to use this weird weapon on Battlefield 5. Today we're gonna use the most unique weapon in each Battlefield game. And we start with Battlefield 5 and we're gonna use the M3 Infrared Sniper. This thing, I'll be honest with you guys, I really don't like it. Mainly because, look at it, it takes up half your screen. You can't see anything with this thing. But it is pretty cool, it's very unique to this game. So we're gonna use it. Our first candidate, look at that. There we go, nice little clean kill. It's a 5 shot kill I believe from far range and in close range it's a 4 shot kill so it's not that amazing in terms of damage output but it has a suppressor and it shoots fairly fast and it's pretty accurate so in the right hands, look at that, if you look against the light it's, I don't know, this filter, I, I don't like it but we're gonna use it anyway. Place a spawn beacon over there and let's continue. Playing outpost, I figured this is a little bit, you know, Kind of a chaotic game mode without a real front line, if you know what I mean. So we can use this suppressor to our advantage like this. Oh, I almost didn't see him. You know why? Because this thing blocks my screen. Come on! Oh, I'm so cold. This is my first game on today. I always have these excuses ready. Don't worry, guys. You can count on me to have these lame excuses. But, hey, welcome to the T-Bag channel. Okay, there we go, we got him. We got him as well, come on. I don't know, I don't ugh, I don't like this weapon. The only reason I'm using it is because it looks cool and it is this weird thing, you know, but in terms of competitiveness, this is definitely not a meta. But I don't know, I I, I dig it, I dig it. Okay. The fast rate of fire does help, so that's good. Be Viking, get out of here! I'm trying to record a video. We can get a couple more kills here before we end. How many how many hits do you want? 69 and I hit him four or five times? What a absolute trash gun. There we go. Now one more ticket and we lose. Just get it over with. Another one. Quickly, just end the match. I don't want to use this gun anymore. There we go. We lost. I don't even care. Let's go to Battlefield 1. Okay, next up, Battlefield 1. And I decided to use the Hell Regal SMG. We could have gone with the SMG 08, as it's probably the most rare gun in the world, at least in the World War 1 era. But I decided to go with the Hell Regal SMG, truly because, you know, its design is so unique. It isn't very unique in terms of how it performs, like the entry infrared in Battlefield 5. You know, that gun was truly unique in the game, you know, there's no other gun like it. But in this game, you know, I decided to go with a gun that's unique in real life. Now back in the day this thing was absolutely overpowered. It isn't anymore in my opinion, it's still very good in the right hands but I never really liked it after the nerf. Ooh, that was close. Reload. We got 60 rounds, we shouldn't... Oh hello. He didn't see me, lucky for us. Luckily we have 60 rounds so we don't have to reload too often but still, you know, when you're missing one round in a magazine you always have to reload. It's, it's a habit. Okay, we're closing in behind enemy lines, I think. Oh, no. Okay, okay. Relax, relax. Throw a smoke grenade down there. Kill this guy in the back. This thing kicks a lot. I didn't think it would. We're still alive, though. Two against one, that's okay. I think I see another one here. And the last guy, come on! I got four piece, I'll take it. And we also have the Hell Regal defensive variant with more rounds in the magazine. So I think I'm gonna use this one. Look at this guy. Look at this. Little tea bag. Get yeah, on. Now a couple people over there. Got one. Don't reload, tea bag. Don't reload. You got 100 rounds left. Okay, so like I said, let's use the bipod. There's a guy right here. He's dead. Okay, we have another one to our left here. There we go. Oh yeah, there's no such thing as random bullet deviation, right? Before we go to Battlefield Hardline, by the way, what do you guys think of the PlayStation 5 console design? I think it looks pretty slick. Obviously, I don't really like the two-tone black and white design, but other than that, it's pretty cool. But obviously, the memes of it are the best part. 
<laughs> okay, here we are in Battle for the Hardline. We are playing Heist. I don't really know what this game would like is to be honest but apparently we need to get these objectives anyway i decided to go with this weapon here the fmg9 it's literally a falling weapon in real life it can fall in half and pretty much fit in your back pocket it's uh, pretty much an smg as you can see it shoots pretty fast there we go so this counts as kill it doesn't really behave any differently compared to other smgs but, you know, in real life, it's a very unique weapon. That's why I chose this one. You also have other, you know, very unique weapons in this game. Such as a harpoon weapon. Oh, I'm gonna take this thing. Anyway, the FMG9 is my pick. Let's see if we can do some damage. We have the package, by the way. There we go. Getaway incoming. Loot secured. There we go. That's it. We need to do that a couple more times. Come on. Bro! Yo, he has the package, but he doesn't know. He has the package, but he needs to get it here, but he doesn't know he has the package. Look! What is he doing? Bro, get up here and... Gr <laughs> what is he doing? We lost it. Are you kidding me? The chopper went away. We could have won so easily. What are you... That's one. Go. Another one. Maybe I can get the heli like this. 73 damage, that's it. Okay, we destroyed the helicopter. That's always good. Oh, we got another one. What is that? Double kill or something like that? There we go, another one. This is a pretty decent position here. Our aim is a little bit sloppy, but uh, we're following some kills right now. Ooh, we got a double kill. I think we stole both of them. There we go, we won. Let's go to Battlefield 4 now. Okay, last but not least, we are on Battlefield 4, and I chose the Mare's Leg to be the most unique weapon in this game. It could have either been the Phantom Bow or this one, and the Phantom Bow, we already tried it in a different video. And I think the Mare's Leg is truly unique in the fact that, first of all, it's the only lever action rifle in this entire game. And on top of that, it is a secondary. So it's like a little pocket sniper rifle, except for the fact that we don't have any sights for this thing. So we're stuck with these iron sights, which are very terrible. So we need to get some kills in order to equip a sight. But besides that, let's just go with it. We missed. We missed again. Okay, I cheated there a little bit because like I said, I'm pretty... I don't like this weapon. Let's try that again. Let's try that again. Okay, we have one candidate over there. One hit. No, no, no. Don't take him from me. There we go. Nice. Our first kill. Oh, this is gonna be such a difficult time. I don't know if we can hit him from here. I can't see him because these sights are so terrible. Okay, I give up. I give up. Next target. There we go, another one. Keep in mind, when you fire an unsuppressed weapon in this game, you appear on the enemy's minimap. All I want is to unlock a sight. That makes it 10 times easier to get kills with this thing. Okay, I see one. That's a headshot. Okay, so it's a one-shot kill to the head at a certain range. I'm 100% sure that after, I believe, let's say 70 meters, it's not a one-shot kill to the head anymore, but that was a one-shot kill. Okay, here we have another one. There we go. Okay, check this out. There we go, we got a kill with the mare's leg. There we go, get out of here, bro. A little tea bag for you. Come on, when do we unlock a scope? That's all I want. One hit. Come on, that should have been a hit. That was right on him. I'm gonna push this guy. Headshot. Okay, we have an ACOG scope. It should be easier now. Let's put it to the test. We're already getting sniped. Can we get a headshot? Yes, that's a headshot, I believe. No, it wasn't. It's a kill anyway. Leave me alone. 
Okay, there we go. That's a headshot. You know, I just want one kill. One kill and I can end the video. No. Of course. There we go. You know what? I'm done, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already. And i see you guys next time.